have room service on Royal Caribbean Mariner of the Seas. This is going to be on my uh, YouTube channel, Royal Caribbean Cruise Chronicles. So here, you want to hold the door? All right. We have, we can put some here and, all right. So we're going to have some, we can put some over here on this table. We'll put them all over here for now. That's fine. All right, so we're getting the room service delivered and we'll be back and show you what we got and do our sampling. Look at that, holy cow, beautiful. Thank you, all right. We'll be back with the unveilings. Here comes the pizza, yeah. Just put it all, yeah, just squeeze it all in there. Thank you, all right, thank you. Okay, so let's see what we have. First, we have chicken quesadillas. Okay. Underneath, I know what we have. Pizza, pizza, pizza. We have pepperoni pizza. Okay. We have Philly cheesesteak. Yum. That's good. And we have hot dog. Hot dog. I forgot we have hot dog. Hot dog with sauerkraut. Yep. And we have the Wagyu beef burger. Ooh, look at that. And when there's another one below it, that's another burger below it. Okay. Yeah. And over here is the salmon. Oh, that's okay. the other. That's the other cheesesteak. Salmon's over here. Salmon. So here's the salmon. All right. Mm, interesting. And then wings. Hot buffalo wings. And over here we have the desserts. We have a chocolate cake. And then we have the royal cheesecake. So that's what we have. And next will be the food tastings. All right, we are back here. And first thing I'm gonna taste is the burger, the Wagyu beef burger. Sorry, let me get it all here. We tried cutting everything in half because we got three people sharing it. I don't usually have bacon on my burger, but for research purposes, we have. So this is the Wagyu beef burger. Mmm. It's a thick Wagyu beef. Mmm, very good. Now, Richard and Landon over here. And so far, what do you guys think? He's gonna try, they're gonna try the burger next. Okay, we have them on the camera. I can get the camera to stop moving. Okay. Very good. Oh my. Thick. Very nice. A thick beef patty. Probably as good as chops. Very good. We got some fries. Mmm. The burger's good. Um, we got some salmon. It looks like it's a little bit different than the salmon I've had before on room service. Looks like they took the skin off. But it is grilled. Food did come hot, and by the way. It is very good temperature. They took like look like they took the skin off. So it's plain salmon. Doesn't have much flavor to it. It has a dill, a little dill cucumber sauce they put on the side. But the salmon, not as good as I remember previously. Not as good as the chops grilled salmon. It's very plain, not seasoned at all. 
but it is salmon. That burger was good. This comes with asparagus. Okay. What do you think? I'm with you on, on the salmon. Salmon is just... Yeah, I have the same thing. I say right. the same thing. It's like Here's my little, my little sampler tray. And I'm going to go for the hot dog next. This crispy bun. It's, it's basically grilled. Crunchy skin on the hot dog. Hmm? Crunchy skin on the hot dog from mm. the grip being on the... On the roller, probably. The hot dog does taste like a New York style hot dog. I wish they wouldn't have toasted the bun. But I like it as good or better than the doghouse, except for the toasted bun. I wish the bun wasn't toasted. Mm. We have chicken, <clears throat> chicken quesadilla, <clears throat> excuse me, chicken quesadilla, and it does come with some guacamole, sour cream, tomato, tomatoes, mm. it's a basic chicken quesadilla. It's got some Monterey Jack cheese. It's warm. It's a basic chicken, chicken quesadilla. Does the job. Have you tried, um, let's see. Yep, chicken quesadilla. Yep. Yeah, just, just did. I'm, I'm with you there. With the basic. Basic chicken quesadilla. Good snack. So by the way, there was one charge for the room. So all this stuff with the with the automatic 15 or 18 percent gratuity was nine dollars eighty three cents, and I tipped the guy extra because I mean we got a lot of food here. So chicken quesadilla is plain. I still have another half of a burger in here, so I gotta take a bite of this. Hmm. That is some really good quality beef. That's really good. So far, the beef burger is my favorite. Okay. Next up. We have wings. Next up, we have the Philly cheesesteak. This looks just like what they serve at Coco K. It has a dipping sauce, like an au jus, if you can see it here. Um, well, right here. It's an au jus. So I'm just going to have it without the au jus. Mmm. The roll is slightly toasted. The beef is tender, has cheese in it, onions, um, bell peppers. And the bread would be good, like if you have a piece of it, you can like dip it in the au jus. Mmm. That's a pretty good. Tasty. Mm hmm. That does the job. But it's pretty much the same thing you get at Coco K. The beef is nice and tender. 
So that's the Philly cheesesteak. Let's move to the next. The next big thing. Everyone wants to know about these wings. So look at these wings. These are the hot buffalo wings. Comes with the blue cheese dressing. I hope. Hope they're not. Hope it's not Thousand Island dressing. Okay. Stop moving, camera. Here we go. Let's see. First, let me see what this. Is that ranch or is that blue cheese? It's blue cheese. It's blue cheese. Okay. So, we're going to try one of these hot buffalo wings. We'll dip it in the blue cheese. Good flavor. I'm not a hot person, so I'm not partaking in this portion. Okay, Richard's going to bypass this. Landon's trying them. I think they're just as good as Playmakers. Me too. Not too hot? No, not too hot, but just enough. Um, yeah, these are, these are really good. They are messy, but the dressing, uh, blue cheese dressing is good. <clears throat> the wings are hot. Comes with some celery. Little carrots. So these wings are just as good as Playmakers. After you eat a couple of these, you start feeling the, the heat coming through. So it's it's hot enough, but not too hot. Big wings, meaty. Perfect. These come in mild hot buffalo or barbecue and I recommend the hot buffalo mm. so that is the wings next gotta have one slice of pizza for video Okay. I'm going to pull the, the pizza box over here for these guys. All right. So here is the pizza. Well, it's basically. No different than Sorrento's. <laughs> Other than you get a whole pizza. I mean, it's the pre made crust. It's, you know, chewy. Not like a crispy crunch. And if you fold it in half, you get two pieces. <laughs> and take a bite. It's not much different. Mmm. What is that you like? Just a little pickle that you had on there. Oh. Tasty. So I think so far, the wings and the burger. The wings and the burger. I cannot let this burger go to waste. Mmm.
it's a half pound patty. Perfectly seasoned, has cheddar cheese, comes with bacon, tomatoes, red onions, and you have condiments with it. This burger is a big hit. Mm. And that burger is followed closely by the wings. These are just as good as Playmakers. Landon, do you agree? I would go burger, then wings, and then the Philly. Mm -hmm. And I like the burger and then the Philly probably next. The hot dog was really good. Um, they have different varieties at the dog house, different bun. This bun would have been really good if they didn't uh, toast it. But the wings are... Mm. Perfect. <coughs> and make sure you have lots of napkins for these wings. <laughs> Very messy. Yep. Mmm. No, the burger's good. One more thing I wanted to add about room service. Someone asked about gluten-free options. Um... When I called room service to ask, they said, at the time you order room service, check which menu options, which menu items can be made gluten-free. And they will try to adjust as necessary. They said, for example, a Caesar salad, they just won't add croutons. Um, some of the other dishes, they may be able to make gluten-free or may not. But I don't think they have options to give you alternative items. Um, like, if you want a chicken breast, I don't think they would be able to do that. So, next up is dessert. So, we'll be back for dessert in a minute. We're back for dessert. I cut these up into thirds so we can try them. So, you should always try the light before the dark. So, I'm going to try the cheesecake first. This is the royal cheesecake let's see mmm it's very really good it's better than the cheesecake in the dining room here hold this and do my video for me okay here we go so this is a very good dense cheesecake It's as close to New York style cheesecake as you can get. And it's on par with Jamie's Italian lemon Amalfi cheesecake. So better than the dining room. I'm gonna go ahead and do my chocolate. This is the royal chocolate cake. It doesn't look, I don't know, we'll see. I'll try it. I should get a whole big piece of this. It's got some caramel on the, on the plate. Sorry, it's a little messy to do here, but anyway. Mmm. It's got a spongy texture. I think it has the ganache chocolate on the top, and the layers are moist. I think it's really good, but the cheesecake is way better. So, all right, I'll take that. All right, so. Best dessert, cheesecake. So there you go, there's room service. And as I said before, it's one price for everything. With the 18% added, it's $9.83. You should tip them more in cash because they brought us a lot of food. So 
I do that and um, so the burger number one on the entrees followed by the wings and then the uh, shaved Philly cheesesteak sandwich was very good um, I like the hot dog compared to the boardwalk doghouse but the bun shouldn't be toasted and of course the desserts cheesecake definitely excellent so there you have it from Mariner of the Seas. There is room service and it's the menu that is consistent across the fleet. So anytime you're hungry for a, an amazing burger, just the burger alone is worth the $7.95 plus gratuities and then the dessert. The salmon has gone downhill, unfortunately. Um, what we didn't get, I have gotten before, was the chopped cob salad, which actually is really good, but we had so much food here. The chicken quesadillas were just chicken quesadillas, nothing special. So if I had to order all this stuff again, I would order the burgers, the wings, and the cheesecake. <laughs> and if you want to get some drinks, bring them from the bar and then bring them to your room. So, and it's a good time and it's one price for all. So thanks for watching. Peace out.